water? Like, don't I need something else to help my floors to be clean? The answer to that is no. So I have a brand new protein swab and I have a piece of raw chicken in this bag right here. Y'all remember, if you've seen my demos, green is good, no protein, pink and purple, the further you go down this, the more protein. Protein is a tiny, tiny particle and bacteria is a little bit bigger. So if you're using our microfiber and it picks up the small, tiny protein, then you know it got the larger, protein, uh, larger particle of bacteria. So let me show you this real quick. Our mop, as you know, comes with a yellow pad that you use dry. I think like the sun is dry, yellow, so this replaces your broom and your um, vacuum, whatever that you would use. You'll no longer need either one of those. But what I'm really wanting to highlight today is our blue wet mop pad. And so I have some water right here. I wet this pad in the water. And I am going to rub this chicken, this raw chicken on the floor. So I'm gonna point you guys down so you can see. And I'm gonna give you a reference point too, so you can really see. I hope y'all can, I hope y'all can see those little knots on my floor. So here are two little dark places in the wood. I'm gonna rub this chicken right over those two dark spots, okay? Ooh, that's gross. I'm going to take my mop pad and I'm just gonna clean through there wet with water, only water, no chemicals needed. And I'm gonna take my protein swab and I'm gonna go right over where those two little knots in the chicken are. Green was good, remember on our swab, green is good. It removed all the protein and it removed all the bacteria on there too. So I'm gonna flip the pad over I'm gonna show you that there's no chicken on my pad either. So if I continue mopping my floor, which I totally am this morning, it stays nice and green. Now some of you are like, well, I just don't even know about her swab. Like, is that a real swab? Is that really chicken? Like, what is this lady doing rubbing chicken on her floor? I'm simulating some of the grossest bacteria we have, right? And so what do you see start to happen? This is real chicken, this is a real protein swab. Two more things I wanna point out about the mop that maybe you have not heard of before. Uh, it has a telescoping handle, so it can go really high or really low. Where you're supposed to keep it is about nose height for you. And then this end, if you've got linoleum and it gets some scuff marks on it, you can get the scuff marks out with that little green ball. And then also, everything on here is intentional. This little guy right here, let me show you what you can do with him. So let's say you wanna walk away to answer the door or you need to run to the restroom and you don't wanna leave your mop just sitting on your floor. You can hang it by that handle. Also, you can offset the pad. You see how that ends floppy? This end gets in your corner and that end will flip up and do your baseboards. So I don't have a baseboard in the screen here because this brick wall back here does not have a baseboard, but we're gonna pretend that this is a baseboard and you can just slide up and down and clean that baseboard. Our mop is amazing. If you have it, you know that. If you don't have it, you probably want one. The best way to get one is to host this month um, for, and get it for free. It's on the reward sheet. And then every other month is also mop month because you can use the money that you earn. You earn money.